both of them have been referenced as standing by the Lord. Who was with him on Mount Transfiguration? Moses and Elijah. Yep. Revelation 11.5 talks about a fire that proceeds out of the mouth of the two witnesses to kill the enemies. Okay? Both Moses and Elijah, both their enemies, guess where they were consumed by? They were consumed by fire. Both both did that. 2 Kings chapter 1 for Elijah, verse 9 through 13. And Moses, number 16, 31 through 35. When the earth opened up and they were consumed, they were consumed in that fire when their mouth opened up and consumed them. Revelation 11, 6 talks about the power to shut the heaven for three and a half years. Yes. Elijah did that. Right. That was Elijah. That was not Enoch. Elijah, 1 Kings 17, 1, there was no rain. You find out how long the rain was in James chapter 5, verse 17. He had stopped the rain for three and a half years. Okay? They have power to turn water into blood. Hello, yeah, who is that? Moses. 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 Exodus chapter seven, verse nineteen and twenty. Now this is my this is my pretty much resistance for my argument. Malachi chapter four. Malachi. Enoch could not be one of the witnesses. Enoch was raptured before the flood. Everybody see that? Yeah. Enoch, wait, was raptured before. before the flood. That's a type of Christian going out before. Tribulation. The tribulation. Mm -hmm. If you take Enoch, then you ruin the whole type. You get ruined the whole type. You can't do that. But here's my here's my piece of resistance, and we're done. Malachi chapter four. I got verse uh... three through six. We'll read it. Look what it says. Verse three. Malachi chapter four, verse three. And ye shall tread down the wicked, and they shall be ashes under the soles of your feet. In the day that I shall do this, say the Lord of hosts. Remember ye the law of who? Moses. Moses. My servant which I commanded unto him in Horeb for all Israel with the statutes and judgments. Behold, I will send you, excuse me? Elijah. Elijah. Elijah, the prophet before, watch it, before the coming of the great and dreadful day of the what? Lord. Lord. Just before, that's before Second the Lord coming. comes back. For Second, coming, Second yeah. Advent. Yeah. You just read it right there, Moses and Elijah. Yep. And it's it, boys. Sorry. Jury's out. Jury's out. <clears throat> We're done. <laughs> Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath, <laughs> yes. Can I add a little bit to that before? Because how I, I'm pretty sure that's talking about the devil. Because if you read the context there, it says... Um, get thee behind me, Satan. And after that, it says, Jesus said unto his, wait a minute, honey. It says here, it says, If any man will come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. For whosoever will save his life shall lose, and whosoever will lose his life for my sake shall find it. And it goes, What shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his soul? That's what the devil tempted him with. All these things will I give thee, if thou wilt fall down and worship me. Now watch. For the Son of Man shall come with the glory of his Father with his angels. Mm -hmm. Just like the devil is with his angels. He's a great mimicker. Right. His angels were with him too. Sure, I'm sure they were. Those were the sure. sum. The Bible talks about the dogs, uh, all that, could be many. being at the Calvary. Like I said, it's you know we'll find out one day in glory, but yeah. I, I believe the way I read it, there's two answers, Moses and Elijah or it's the devil. I believe the way I read it, it's talking about the devil. But you get at it. You know, Doc believes it's it's you know, it's Moses and Elijah, but I don't really care, to be honest with you. I mean, it's just Doc's not right all the time. All right. I mean, I just thought he was talking to the disciples. He was. He was. He was here. He was talking to them. But you, there were certain people you couldn't see that were there. That's he knew that too. they were there. No, that's true okay? too. Okay. Any questions now? <laughs> Where to begin? How long was that? How long were we here tonight? It's two hours. Two hours even? Two hours. I told you three, so I saved you an hour. Holy moly. <laughs> but do you see but did you see the whole point about no. that son of God, how yeah. important it is? Yeah. No, we just no. throw it off like it really doesn't matter. But it does matter. Yeah, yeah. amen. It does. Amen. There's, a right. There's a lot behind that. There's a lot behind that. And the devil, of course, wants to keep people blind to it. Right. Amen. And, uh, that's why people are dying and going to hell, because they don't want to be a child of the king. Yeah. It blinds those minds. Before and even in uh, Job 38, it talked about the morning stars staying together in order to send them to God, shout for joy. 
Yeah, morning started plural. I don't want to say that Jesus, in Revelation, I say that Jesus was the morning star. Bright morning star. The bright yeah. morning star. Right. But how, how, how can we have the morning star plural? Yeah. Because at that particular time, he's talking about the morning stars. Uh, like he said, who said bright uh -huh. morning star? A little different. Bright morning star. Those are morning stars. Also, stars are also likened to to uh, stars. Also, likened to angels. Ma Ma you know, you know, Malik. Malik, the god Malik. You know what that means in Hebrew? It means angel. They worship angels. Why? Sons of God. Huh. Yeah. Malak is Hebrew for angel. There you go. <coughs> yeah. Hebrew for it. I've heard where that's where a lot of the um, uh, the gods come from. Oh. Thor and all that oh, yeah. stuff. It, it's <coughs> incredible strength, men of renown. Oh, right? It's all tied into the tied into that. That's what renown means. Men, evil, evil men. Renown means evil. <laughs> not you know, not not really just evil. You know, it's weird because I actually heard like no, I don't know how true it is, but a lot of. Uh, like ancient tribes and stuff knew about giants and they were actually like carnivores where they would actually eat people. <laughs> Look at that word, renown, re-own. So they re -own themselves, they claim ownership of themselves. <laughs> Any questions outside of this so we can get done? You know, I don't know if I want to go home now. All right, so what would you think? Awesome. There's a lot there, right? Yeah. We covered a lot of bases, man. Amen. Okay. Uh, if you want, buy the video, twenty nine ninety five. Okay. All proceeds go to taxes. I mean, all proceeds go to taxes. Yeah, man. Amen. Amen. No, no, I'm only, I'm only. But uh, praise the Lord, we're done. Amen. It's Amen. good, huh? Amen. But that you got a lot there too. A lot of meat. A lot of meat. All right, let's get dismissed. We took an offering, right? Did we do that? Yes.